Hi there. I am so excited to see you today. And what I want to do is read to you one of my favorite books, Huff and Puff Have Too Much Stuff. My name is Tish Robbie, and I am a children's book author, which means I write children's books. And I wrote Huff and Puff Have Too Much Stuff. Now, I write the words for my books, but I do not draw the pictures. So I'm excited to show you these beautiful pictures by my friend Jill Guile. And Jill lives in England, and I live in New York City, so we're a long way apart, but we love creating books together. So you're just gonna love Huff and Puff Have Too Much Stuff. Now, when I read it to you, I want you to think about three things. Every story I write has a beginning and a middle and an end. And every story you write will have a beginning and a middle and an end. So when I read this book to you in just a couple of minutes, I want you to listen for, and I'll help you, figure out what is the beginning, what is the middle, and what's the end. Here we go. When I read this book to you, let's look at where the beginning is, the middle is, and where the end is. Here comes the beginning. Huff and Puff Have Too Much Stuff by Tish Robbie. Pictures by Jill Guile. One day, Huff said, Look at us, Puff. We push and pull. A lot of stuff. Let's go get more stuff, said Huff. That sounds good to me, said Puff. Huff got some books and a red truck. Take us too, said some cows and ducks. Puff got a kite, a bike, and a boat. Take me, said a goat in a pretty pink coat. Huff got rugs, bugs, cats, hats, and a ball. Big stuff, small stuff, they got it all. Huff tried pulling the train up to the top. Puff tried pushing the train, but they had to stop. Here comes the middle. We have too much stuff, said Huff. I need stuff, said Farmer Fluff. I need things to fill my farm. I need pets to fill my barn. You can have our stuff, said Huff. Welcome to my farm, said Farmer Fluff. There's lots of room for pets and stuff. Here comes the end. So now there goes just Huff and Puff. We don't need much stuff, said Huff. We have you and me, and that's enough. The end. Well, I hope you love this book as much as I do. I'm very, very proud of it. And now I wanna do something really fun for you all. I am called the singing author. And I'm called the singing author because I sing and I love to write. I'm a singer and a writer. So when I go to visit schools across the country and around the world, I always sing to the students when I'm there. So I'm gonna do something super special for you today. I am gonna sing the whole book, Huff and Puff. So hold on, cause here it comes. I'm gonna sing the book for you. Huff and Puff have too much stuff. One day Huff said, look at his puff. We push and pull a lot of stuff. Let's go get more stuff, said Huff. That sounds good to me, said Puff. 
I've got some books and a red truck. Take us too, said some cows and ducks. Puff got a kite, a bike, and a boat. Take me, said a goat in a pretty pink coat. Huff got rugs, bugs, cats, hats, and a ball. Big stuff, small stuff, they got it all. Huff tried pulling the train up to the top. Puff tried pushing the train, but they had to stop. We have too much stuff, said Huff. I need stuff, said Farmer Fluff. I need things to fill my farm. I need pets to fill my barn. You can have our stuff, said Huff. Welcome to my farm, said Farmer Fluff. There's lots of room for pets and stuff. So now there goes just Huff and Puff. We don't need much stuff, said Huff. We have you and me and that's enough. The end. So I know all of you love to read and you love to write and you love to sing. So I'm gonna to sing to you my singing author song. I'm the singing author, it's what I do. And I am proud of all of you. You read and write and I can tell that you do it very well. Keep reading and writing and you will see you're all authors just like me. So keep reading and writing and singing. And remember, everywhere you go and everything you do, always remember, I love you. Mwah! See you soon. To learn more about me and my books, go to tishrabi.com, T-I-S-H-R-A-B-E. If you'd like me to visit your students at a school author visit, contact me at tishrabi at gmail.com. Keep reading, writing, and singing.